Hello everybody, the top spot in the eight-man south is up for grabs tonight with Joliet visiting Park City. Jayhawks are also welcoming back starting quarterback Hayden Ward, who's been out since September 11th. Joliet would strike right away. Stop me if you've seen this before. Rye Brostrup is gonna take the opening kick all the way back. Looks like he's bottled up, but he breaks some tackles, he shows off some incredible balance, and then he hits the gas pedal to pull away. Here's Ward making his presence felt. He takes the keeper around the end, makes a man miss, and scores to put the Jayhawks up two touchdowns. Brostrup then with his second touchdown of the first half. He just sneaks in, and Joliet's up 18-0. But here comes Park City. Jacob Gochi airs it out to Tate and Kin's father, who comes down with it, and he's going to win a race to the end zone. And then later in the second quarter, Kin's father is going to end up with it on the reverse. Plenty of field in front of him, and he's going to waltz in for six to tie things up. Joliet would lead 34-18 at the break, but Park City would rally again. Gochi takes this one up the far sideline. No one's going to catch him. It's an eight-point game. Now we're tied at 34 in the fourth quarter, and Ward finds Seth Bailey for the nine-yard touchdown as Joliet goes up 42-34. Just over two minutes to play now, and Gochi to the end zone to Tucker Johnstone, and he comes down with it. The two-point try, though, is no good, and Joliet leads 42-40. Precisely 58 seconds later, Gochi and Johnstone hook up again this time from 10 yards out as Park City stuns Joliet for the 46-42 win. I couldn't be happier with my team. I mean, I love each and every one of them. There's, there's nothing, I mean, sure, I caught the football, but I can't do that without the rest of the team. We told ourselves our team goal at the start of the season would be number one in our conference. We, we weren't worried about state yet. We were taking a step at a time, and we wanted to be number one, and this is on the road. Park City is back in action next Friday against Sheridan, while Joliet will host Absorkey on Thursday. For MTN Sports, I'm Alec Boffinger.